look at this goddamn ridiculous thing of the wildly different, the wildly different art style that this this one an anime short film had. <laughs> look at it, ridiculously realistic Karen. It's it's so wrong, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, also a random fact is when he appeared in the first anime. When he appeared in the first anime, he had the same voice actor as Dr. Eggman from Sonic, and I like that. And it was a shame that in Generation he didn't have the same voice actor. Also, look at this other weirdly realistic Karen. Like, seriously, this, this man looks different in every single incarnation. Look at, look at that! Look at that! Who is that? Like, he looks really different even compared to every other character in that manga. Every other character in that manga was like shoujo style, and then he looked like a god goddamn horror villain. It's like, no one knows how to draw Grandpa. No one knows how to draw Grandpa. It's just the unknown forbidden knowledge of Grandpa. <laughs> no one knows how to draw Grandpa, even the people who made Grandpa. This is the one I was talking about. This is the hilariously terrible, terrible single picture from the anime. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at that face. Rectangles mode. Oh, why don't I have a, have a nice, nice image of Dr. Snap? He looks so cute. Cute smile, Grampy. Grandpa images time. Which, as we all know, is the best time. Also, this is... Uh... This is the only high-quality image of Dr. Snap in existence. Only half of him on a, on a wallpaper. It's a really nice damn wallpaper, though. And that's his Japanese name, which sounds... Like, super cute, doesn't it? It doesn't really mean anything. It's only in the English version that everyone had names after different card games. Like, it was always called- the game was always called Joker, but they didn't have everyone named after card games in Japanese. Apparently, Karmaso is like- the name comes from mixing, like, the word Karma and the Japanese word for the Darkonium Crystals. So apparently Maso or something like that. I've no idea what it means, but I've just learned this from facts about people who know Dragon Quest on Twitter. I'm finding all my Vex and images from Kingdom Hearts, but he's not quite a grandpa, he's more like an uncle. He's got that mad, mad side of grandpa aesthetic, but he's like a dad age person. Also, I ship him with Lexi is so bad. Like, seriously, they raised a goddamn child together. Basement trio, best characters. Best family, I believe in them forever. Snappy. Weird blob Snappy. I still can't believe this guy turned into such a creepy monster design, and yet I still adore him and cherish him, and he continues to not be scary in any way possible. The least scariest Aldrich abomination has ever existed. Such a sweet man, and then a sweet man larger and more melty version. His sweetness can be never be restrained. Another cute and pleasant snappy image! Look him, he read bookings. Love he. I would just make a lovely collage of all the grandpas. I wonder how many images of grandpa can fill this page without lagging it out. Everyone will cherish every single grandpa, otherwise you're not allowed to be in my streams anymore. Large. Large grump. Gramp too large, gramp too powerful. I am currently in the progress of trying to make a plush toy of Dr. Snap, and this is the progress I have made so far, but the image is really large for some reason. Yeah. Progress of making a plushy Dr. Snap, I've gotten this far. He is here. Snap is here. He is here to bless our screens. This relaxing music is very fitting for a stream which has now just become me talking about how much I love Dr. Snap a lot. Dr. Snap enjoying a lovely milkshake with a curly straw because it's what he deserves. Another random commission I got from a friend of him in super silly monster form. I must find every possible grand period in the entirety of history. We just have a chilled out stream sometime where I just, I just constantly talk about all these characters I love. And everyone has to endure it, and that's just that's just what it is now. That is the stream. There is no further knowledge to the stream, and that is all of that exists forever. Good reference for Dr. Snap and Karen. <laughs> I should do this when I'm a lot more awake. I should just have a stream of just blabbering on about characters I love. Or just some other sort of just chilled out talking stream. That'd be really nice. What is this? I want to make like a video explaining exactly how much I love Dr. Snap and like all of his plot and everything. Have a little cute dancing Karen to bless your life. He, he shall go here. Oh, here's a cute one. It's um, Karen's trading card in in uh, thing, which is like the only trading card he's ever had. 
and also the only other image that Sugimori has ever drawn of him, and it's also the only the canonical, canonical proof that the, the heartwarming Rotom backstory is definitely with Karen, and he does have a, a cute heart, and he does have a one Pokemon friend that he loves and cherishes. Look him smile. Him only smile he ever do. Smile of genuine and happy. With small cute friend. It's proof. Heart to grandpa. He's not pure evil. He's got a heart. He's got a love. He's got cherishedness. He's got a trading card. I will defend grandpa to my grave. Oh, also here's one. Is um, Dr. Snap Monster Form. Um, bestiary entry from Dragon Quest Monsters Joker 3. Which is a game that we haven't had in English. But... I've, I've got it on reliable, reliable support source and that's his, um, his bestiary entry in this game. It, what it means is, apparently it says, um, a very terrifying monster, however his personality is actually surprisingly cute. And that's his bestiary entry for the future games he appears in. And it's, it's very cool that he appears in future games, even if he does appear forever in his scary monster form. But it's, it's good luck. Even if, even if a sad doctor died, he can live on in our hearts and in the competitive meta of the games. So apparently he is quite popular now, which is good. Everyone should always constantly like main the grandpa in every game. Where are the rest of my grand images? Give me my grimages! Give me my grimages! More bad images of Karen! <laughs> bad images of Karen! A good and healing commission image I got from uh, Astro Dasher on Twitter is Dr. Snap kindly offering you a cup of tea. The only grandpa characters I ever dislike are like perverted grandpas who hit on people younger than them. I don't like that. That's a bloody anime trope of grandpas who hit on really, really young girls. That's just gross. But aside from that, every grandpa is a, is a precious friend who should be cherished. I must plaster the entire screen in snappy commissions. I cherish every image of Dr. Snap that anyone has ever drawn for any, any reason of any joy forever. More snappages! More snappages! More snappages! What is the plural of snaps? I suppose Dr. Snappies are. Dr. Snaps, Dr. S Dr. Snappies, Snappage Doctors, Dr. Snappages? Who knows? Who knows? There should be many more of him. Everyone should have a Dr. Snap to hug. He should use his newfound monster powers to multiply into infinite sizes and then hug everyone simultaneously. Hands you a Dr. Snap. So many motivational snap images! So if there's anyone out there who wants commissions, who wants money, I am so willing to give everyone all of my money to, to, to make motivational snap images. This is my life now. From the moment that Dr. Snap became my fav favourite character, all of my money was destined to go to, to increasingly adorable Dr. Snap images. That is now the purpose for, for which I acquire cash. Hey, I have a preliminary sketch of a good commission I got. Of Dr. Snap hugging every single Dragon Quest slime monster. So, okay, I think we are done now with, with Bunny just shoves a million Dr. Snap images on the screen. And we might be ready to continue on with our game. <laughs> I will show you every Dr. Snapper that has ever been Snapper. I can also link you to every Dr. Madaman that has ever been Dr. Madaman. And also every Karen that has ever been Karen. Like, when you are a fan of an unpopular grandpa, you will know every single artist who has ever drawn that unpopular grandpa. I've, like, d endowed myself with the knowledge of every grandpa image that exists on the entirety of the internet. I can curse you of this knowledge, too. I can replace the entirety of your brain with Dr. Snap images. And you shall be like me. You shall become corrupted by the darkness too! I think I will- Should I leave the big- the, the cute little Snappy by there? Should I leave this cute Snappy? Should I leave that cute Snappy? Oh, I thought there's another cute Snappy in the corner. Anyway, every- everyone should love Dr. Snap! In conclusion. In conclusion, this was the entire purpose of the stream all along, was to brainwash you into also ador adoring these grandpas. And now let's continue along, because I have forgotten totally what we were even doing.